What's up? How y'all doing? If you want to start a podcast today, come on down to Buzzsprout. It's going to be the link in the description. If you join today, you will get an Amazon, $20 Amazon gift card. Click the link, sign up, go ahead. What, what you waiting on? Let's get to it. For sure. Okay, I did it. Welcome back to the podcast, the Young Funny Black. We your host, man. I'm Reed. To my left, you boy, not <laughs> you would take, man. Now, and, you know, Mar- 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 probably getting the nails done, but you know, how, how, how you doing today, my boy? Shit, man, I'm, I'm blessed. Amen. I'm blessed. If Amen. I woke up and see another day. Right. Hey, you did. I'm blessed. Speak facts. Sure, facts. So before we get into it, we gotta speak about it. We gotta talk about the sponsors. Okay, talk to me. So, Highbrow Brow, High Dribble is a comedy podcast with serious experts. Every week, stand-up comedian Anthony Jeanette asks one of his comedy friends to help him interview a new academic or politician on a subject way out of their depth on. The podcast goes to all places, to best drunk conversations when you're trying to figure it out from a wide range of random and interesting topics. You'll learn a lot about what's going on through a lens of being funny and curious. It's never a TED Talk. So listen to Highbrow Dribble on the podcast on your favorite podcast app or go to www.highbrowdribble.com. And on to the next one. I always get ads free. I got my podcast up and running, but how do I get ads? So let me tell you about Podcorn. Podcorn is a marketplace connecting podcasters to amazing podcast sponsorship opportunities such as host read ads, interview segments, uh, the cut, ugh, <laughs> discussions, uh, and more. <laughs> With Podcorn, there's always there's never no a middleman. Podcasts of all sizes can browse and choose opportunities right on the platform. Set their rates and collaborate with brands directly. You never give up any rights to your podcast, and Podcorn is here to support you at every step to ensure you're protected and compensated for every work that you do for brands. Podcorn has helped us get paid the right way with no money being held up. After the job is done, as soon as your sponsor approves the ad, you get paid quickly and easily. Click the link in our show notes to show up Podcorn and start browsing sponsorship opportunities. And huge thanks to Podcorn for sponsoring this episode. So let's get into it. Oh, what are reading a book? <laughs> That's what it felt like. Let me send me script, my boy. What's happening? How you doing today? You know, I just answered it. Yeah, I know. I just make sure you good. You ready? Yeah. I'll say let's get into it. <laughs> So yeah. everybody know everybody calling my man's money bag Joe, Fact. Mr. Joe Biden. So not them big bills. So 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 people are getting their stimulus checks in, and it's a lot going on. It's a lot going on. So oh, crazy, crazy. what have you seen from how people are been acting? Right. Acting ignorant, a little different. Acting ignorant, out of themselves. Motherfuckers out here going on killing sprees and shit just to get some bucks. You feel me, bro? Did you did you see that family? Like he really shot his. To my dog when he killed four people. Yes, in yeah. the family over stimulus deals. I saw, bro. I saw this shit on Facebook. That is so crazy. On Facebook, you right? Because that's what I mean. You feel me? You feel what I'm saying? It be a lot of people on there. Yeah, <laughs> but some you know somebody some people said on Facebook, but right. this one had got her hair like pulled out the back of her head, like she no. had got jumped. By like family and friends type shit because oh, they was wrong with some of her her stimulus and her you know what I'm saying her tax money right all over money for what for what go get your own money yes <laughs> talk yeah. talk your talk real quick cause like you are bugging you bugging over a little bit of money that's not a lot of money that's a little bit of money that's why you get boy but it's never that deep to go kill somebody to fight nigga yeah that's what I'm saying like. You got them um, fighting people over some money and you killing people. Look, I, look, how did that make you look? First off, you look dumb. You look dumb. Let me tell y'all something. No kill. I'm not going to do it. But McDonald's is hiring. <laughs> <laughs> Minimum wage, what, 7, 25, 7, 50, something like that. 
Something like that. You gotta make dollars, you feel what I'm saying? So you can do something. Don't be out there killing people over no motherfucking money. You feel what I'm saying? Exactly, because like. That shit is bogus, you feel It's bogus, and, and it make you look crazy. That shit, Like you ain't never had something. And let's, and let's not. There are people out there flexing too. Oh yeah, <laughs> oh, you know I'm y'all got that flesh and with that whole fourteen. Right? The whole fourteen. I know. At I, one time, I know. I see. I can count. I can still say it. Why you throw me? I'm counting. Twenty, twenty, twenty. You feel me? Mm. I'm counting it. Watch out. That's that be flexing a little bit, but I ain't gonna. That's say funny. That's I ain't, funny. I'm just, I ain't gonna say nothing. You know, I be peeping. We <laughs> we see you. Guys. We see, see you over here. You know what I'm saying? You weren't doing that a couple weeks ago. All I'm saying is this: right. we're gonna be asking people gonna blow that shit like right, the wind. Oh. And be done and be gone. Oh, man. Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> they had their five seconds and I up. So. Yeah. Five seconds of fame. Five seconds. Nah, they be about to go spin on some bullshit. Mm. Speaking of uh, the tragics, though, have you seen what happened in um, Atlanta with the um, oh, yeah. the man who shot um, all those Asian women? Man. What was that? A uh, spa? What they was, was at a spa. He went to three different spas. That's ridiculous. Who are how, how many people killed? Was eight? It was eight Asian women. Eight Asian women. Yeah. And who was the one that was in the cook killers? It was it was this white twenty year old white male. It was a Caucasian male. And did you hear what the police officer said? Nah, what did he say? He was like, oh, um, he just you know he was up to the end of his rope and he was having a bad day. He was who? Having a bad day. He was who? Having a bad day. Say what now? He said he was having a bad day. <laughs> Say what now? Having a bad day. He said he was having a bad day. After killing eight people that's having a bad day. You know who having a bad day? Mass The women's Robert Aaron Long. Mm. May I motivate Sex sexual addiction? What the hell kind of sexual addiction you got to make you goddamn want to kill some motherfuckers? Mm. You feel me? Bro, I don't, don't want to hear about none of that. I don't say this. Mm. I have a ass of bad days, but I ain't not to you feel me. Exactly. Kissing niggas, killing it. I ain't out here knocking these head off. Oh, over some ra- over some race, bro. Ain't no way. You feel me? like like this like I said. Oh, you feel That's me? Ain't no bro. way. Everybody got their own. Everybody got their own story. You right. feel what I'm saying? If brother depressed because he ain't getting no little play, if he ain't getting no little oop oop, right? Then he need to take it up with, with him. It's porn. Go watch. Go watch porn. That was true. You feel me? Right. Watch it on. But you got you about to go to jail, so you about to Kill get a, you about to get a whole lot of that, you feel me? Oh yeah. You feel what I'm talking about? Yeah, you know, <laughs> that won't do the soap. <laughs> at all, at all. It's over with. You feel me? Yeah. But on some real shit though, it's like, bro. That's that's that's, so that's, that's that's some that's some BS, you feel me? Because it's like bro, it's like people out here who have bad days. You feel what I'm saying? Exactly. Motherfucker, I have a bad day every once in a while, everybody do everybody perfect, you feel me? But we ain't like killing nobody, so that don't exactly. make that an excuse. Exactly, don't make an excuse for him for doing yeah. something. I agree. You, know what, you know what I'm saying? But for the people who not mentally though, exactly, because it's, it's, it's they not they not gonna see. You feel what exactly. I'm saying? Exactly. That if it said, bro, if it, if it was a, 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 a African American, oh yeah, one of us, right? Oh, he, he's a thug. He, 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 he doing it. He he thugging. You feel yeah. La da da da. You feel me? Mm-hmm. But a Caucasian man do it, he having a bad day. He having a bad day? Boy, That's bull. <laughs> damn bullshit. Nobody wanna hear that. Nobody wanna hear that shit, man. And that's just like that's just like the I don't know if you heard about you remember Jeremy Lynn played yeah. NBA. Yeah. He in the G League, somebody called him coronavirus. I heard about that. Like I heard about it. they called that nigga coronavirus on the court. On the court. Like on the court. But you know how that builds up? Cause when when you got a person that was like, you know, yeah. The, the China flu, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It just, it's racist, bro. It's, and people so ignorant, they don't even care. They just so ignorant, just so ignorant. What's that? Ooh, woo! Breaking news, Nadja. So Sweetie has officially broke up with Quavo. No, 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 no. Nah. She, he broke up with her. He broke up. He broke up with her because she wanted to have a little train. Wanted to have a little two two. Yeah. Feel me? Would have got there. Yeah. The video. You feel me? We, please put the video. We gonna put the video for you because I. I, 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 I oh my god. Oh wow. And okay. you want to make him happy finally because he you put him through hell. So a threesome, right? You put him through. A hell. threesome, right, ladies? Right. Threesome. I normally talk to. Men who are cultured, who's been around the world, who know a lot of people. Right. Um, it's so, on you, though. You yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. I understand that, but because he's doing everything right, 
I'm going to give him the honor of picking the nigga who we gonna have a threesome with. Oh! Cause we fine, she bad. <laughs> we know you talking about that on the pandemic. You feel me? Yo, you, yo. If you haven't yo, seen it, go back. But look, let me tell y'all something. Too much betrayal. First of all, I don't want him. First him. off, let me just ask if you in a relationship, right? Are you going on a show that's of your exes to talk on them, to help them anyway? Bruh, let me tell you something. And you know you in the public. Let me tell you something. Bro, I don't I don't care about none of that. I don't care who podcast it is. Right. I don't care whatever podcast podcast talk show, whatever you want to call it. Right. You feel what I'm saying? I don't care. If me and you are a thing, if yeah. me and you gotta look out there and sit around boom boom going on. Right. You feel me? Wow, wow, wow. Why? Wow. Wow. What's the point? What you what you dead though? What you dead for? Yeah, exactly. What are, what are y'all talking for? What, what is the for? conversation? There's no yeah. should be no line of conversation. It should be no line of conversation. And I'm gonna be I'm gonna be right there. Looking at him. Exactly. <laughs> Waiting for him. What would you smile? What would you smile? Why you smile? You know? Yeah, why, why, why you... Pre- and she was... He, bro was pressing her man hard. He was pressing him. The whole time. But she was catching it. You feel me? Yeah. She was catching it. Oh, yeah. She, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. But this is my thing. I'm, this is what I, this is what I want to hear. Though, you feel Go me? ahead. So, you know, I be, I be doing a little lurking. Right. So, you know, when I, when I was looking into it, you feel me? Now, like yesterday, last night, something like that. You know, so, you know... Quavo still follow her. Right. But she don't follow him. Mm. Now, so now, she had dangerous intentions. Now, listen, listen to this. Go ahead. Now tell me how you seen me. Mm. But Quavo still got the pictures of you and him up on his Instagram. Mm. And you still got pictures of you and him up on your Instagram. Mm. Especially on Valentine's Day. Right. Now how you seen me when you still doing it? Exactly. Mm. You trying to play both parts. So you telling me that when you single, you just keep all your boyfriends on your page and you on you on the Exactly. Man, man look, I wasn't born last night. I wasn't born last night. <laughs> I wasn't born last talk night. Your talk. talk your talk. Talk your talk. Hey, you said I'm up today. <laughs> now, 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 if she was single, would you slide? Nigel, we know you've been trying to slide. Would I slide? Are you going to? Would I am I? What? <laughs> but let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. First of all, right. I'm gonna say, bro, you gotta be smooth. How you be smooth? You feel me? You gotta got them right. little razzle dazzle, a little spice. You feel a little me? Little bit of spice. Put that little pinky toe in the door. <laughs> That's the thing you know you in the right. You feel me? Right. But what I slide? Of course I would slide. What man would? Right. But what she said though was it was out of pocket. Feel me? But then again, though, you feel what I'm saying we don't really know the real reason why people was just speculating, saying. You right. know what I'm saying? And Quavo broke up with her because of the comments that she made on the on the, the little little thing they had going on. Right. You feel me? So we don't really know what why they broke up, but hey, that's crazy. That's you know, but you know you had to speak on that because you know it, it's it's gonna come out sooner or later. It always comes to the light. Remember we talked? I ain't, no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hold up. Yeah. Can we circle back for a minute? So. Along with the stimmies coming out and stuff like that, yeah. I don't know if you know, uh, have people been doing these PPL loans? Mm-hmm. So it's like a it's like a stimulus loan in, that's in the package, and people are going down. They are trying to fraud. It's a stimulus loan. Yeah, but it's but they getting more money than they're supposed to be getting. Four million. Four million. Four million. They getting four million. Yes. They getting four. Four million. Four million. And, Show they, me how and there do. are people are going that Show me how to do it. <laughs> right now. They are going down. Hundred hundred thousand. Oh, yeah. It was a girl in Charlotte. They caught she got a hundred thousand. It was a girl in Charlotte. Yeah. Damn, we in Charlotte right now. Exactly. What's she at? <laughs> Locked up. They won't so so if, if, if y'all are gonna do this, make sure y'all have your papers when they come knock on that door. Man, that's why you gotta be smooth. Why you be smooth? You feel me? Man, you, you can't, can't overdo it. First of all, I feel like they overdo it. Like that, yeah, you you ODing like you think they're not gonna notice four mil. Bruh, the IRS be on this shit. Bro. Stop playing. That's, IRS bro, will about, knock upon your door. We talking about four mil. Yeah, that's four mil tickets. Exactly. Hey. You you think you think them damn uh them car people was on your ass before the IRS is gonna be on your ass forever. Why? Why? If you trying to scam, right? Why are you still here? (laughs) Go somewhere somewhere else. else. (laughs) Let 
what are you doing? Oh my so God. you so you will get out the stage. But I'm gone. He said I'm out of there. I'm gone. Right. Like the, the wind. Mexico. Oh, just like me. Okay, let's go down to the border of Mexico. Okay. So some people are getting because now in Mexico you can get a six month visa and live there for six months and they they taxes like they have no tax and down there it's like it's low living it's cheap living like way cheaper than it is in the United States mm -hmm. and it's the new popular thing would you consider doing something like that no why so not living in Mexico they go crazy out there. <laughs> he said they go crazy out there. I ain't trying to be fit and be funny, but also but you know they. they go I, mean, crazy. I mean, they go crazy everywhere. You feel right. what I'm saying? It got to be beautiful parts. I though. just don't get me wrong. I would, I would, you know, what I'm saying, look at Mexico as a as a little vacation little spot. You feel right. me? But as far as me just li living for six months, nah, my boy. <laughs> Nine hundred a month. Huh? Nine hundred a month mansion. Nine hundred a month. Yeah. Oh yeah, in the mansion. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah. <laughs> Nine hundred a month. I mean, however long mansion. you need me to stay down there, they got for six I'm months, down, and then you can get another. Hey, I'll another. be down there for about another two, six months. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be down there. I'll be down there. Hey, you gotta get right. You got. Hey, I get down there and start me up a little goddamn little peach stand. Sell some little fruit on the side. Not the peach stand. My goddamn mm -hmm. straw hat. Oh, my, hey, I promise you, the straw hat will be set. I got the little nine hundred a month coming in. Got my little side hustle. Exactly. I ain't got nothing to worry about. You ain't got nothing to worry about. <clears throat> Except to you can stay out the way that car's head. Mm -hmm. Hey, I'm telling you, I'm t hey. Hey, <clears throat> hello. I ain't got time for my mom to get my head, my head, male hungry. <clears throat> exactly. They go crazy, you know. I don't want no parts. They dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> they dangerous. <laughs> hey. Hey, dangerous. Oh, speaking of Mexico, why we down there in Mexico? Mexico's government has finally legalized marijuana everywhere. Honestly, bro, it's just, it's, it's people legalizing marijuana nowadays, it's, it's not even becoming a big surprise to me. Right. Because they got to understand, bro, no matter how long you try to, you know what I'm saying, keep right. it illegal, it's that in the third, it's, it's always it's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna always be a thing. It's always gonna come around some way or somehow. Right. You know what I'm saying? Just like that. And now they starting to see that there's lots tons of money in it. And that's but, but and, see, and they're trying to profit off yeah. of it while trying to hold yeah. standards down to people. You know what I'm saying? But see what people understand. You can't get it both bro. ways. That's what that's what Cali been doing. Exactly. Cali been having that marijuana help out the economy well living down there. They been exactly. Doing it. But they still but then now like you know, Cali is legal, but they're still cracking down in most states. You know what I'm saying? You can't you can't have it both ways. You want to make money off of, but at the same time, you want to put people in prison. You know what I'm saying? That's all right. So let me ask you this. Right. So, ooh, ooh. so if they was to legalize marijuana, right? You feel me here? Down here, North Carolina, South Carolina. Ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. Do you think that people still gonna go to jail for trying to distribute? Even though they don't have their, you feel me? They got their own look. You feel me? Ooh. Obviously, yes. Thank unless, you. unless there's something put in place. You know what I'm saying? They gotta have. They gotta come with a different rule system. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So because it makes no sense. But what they really gonna try and do is, you know what I'm saying? Feel like to get your license, you gotta meet an unreal criteria. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so that's my. That's my thing. How are they gonna treat people that's getting out off of those charges? Would they if they try to get back into that business, are they gonna be allowed to? You know what I'm saying? Probably not. And that's when I, and that's the and that's like a disadvantage. You yeah, yeah. you can make money from it now, but when they was trying to make money off it before, yeah, yeah. you took their freedoms away to make money. You know what I'm saying? Now you making money, you let them back out, but they can't do what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? That makes no sense. So with that, you know what I'm saying? You you gotta get now. Have you seen LeBron is now part owner of the Red Sox? That's black excellence. Black excellence. Black excellence. But let me tell you, but red off the rest as a player. That's why to me in in my book. <laughs> in my book. You know you know I'm with you. In my little book. scroll. <laughs> it ain't that big long read like right. that. But in my little scroll, right? Then, Brian is the look, bro. He he the he the goat. He's the goat. He the goat, bro. Mike only did one thing. Right. Two things. That's played basketball. Right. Came out with the shoes. The shoes, yeah. And the Hornets. And the Hornets. <laughs> he do got the Hornets. He do got the Hornets. 
Lamella Ball. Now listen. <laughs> this is how, how long might been a little leader, a little organization? Hey, they've about been trash for a long time. About 10, 15. 10 15 years. <laughs> yeah, it's been a long ass time. Kimball got his ass up out of there. Kimball was down for it. Yeah. And they barely made the playoffs. You know what I'm saying? Now don't get me wrong, Mike, good man. Yeah. But I feel like some 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 good players don't need to be organization owners. You feel what I'm saying? Right. Because it's taking you it's why why it's taking you so long. You to get right. It's exactly. taking you so long. You feel me? But then exactly. you got Braun on the other hand, bro. This man Braun, he's a basketball player. He started a school. School. You feel what I'm saying? And, and he's invested in everything. And yeah. everything. Space Jam 2 coming yeah. out soon. Space Jam yeah, 2. He, he is a producer. Like, <laughs> he makes a producer. Yes, he does it all. He does it all. Didn't even go to college. And didn't go to college. Mm. But but he but you And they tried to put but, you in the box. But, but you part owner uh. of the Red Sox, my boy. Exactly. Boy, that boy thug. Boy. He going crazy. He going crazy. Hey, he on it, and then he in every movie now. You know, he do a little acting. He did, he did that on everything. What can he do? Thug. And he's he about to win MVP. He th- I don't know. Maybe over. Maybe home. He should have won. won last year. Oh yeah, Giannis he definitely should have won. So yeah, Giannis. Should've I think won. he's overrated. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, but that's con- we, we that's conversation for <laughs> that's just, that's conversation for another time. That's a conversation for another time. So. Have you heard about the Kirk Franklin incident? Nah. So you know Kirk Franklin is the gospel singer. That's yeah. That's a little too R and B. Just yeah, a little that, bit. You know that little. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah. 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 Kirk Franklin. So he was on a call with his his son, and they was arguing, having a disagreement, like black parents and kids do sometimes. You know what I'm uh-huh. saying. Now, the child, his son is thirty three years of years of age, uh-huh. and he recorded their their conversation. Oh, childish. And and Kirk Franklin called him a bitch ass nigga, and everybody on Instagram and Twitter is agreeing <laughs> with him <laughs> because you are thirty you are thirty three years old recording you and your father's mess. Um, man, look. first of all, that's first funny. of all, I don't give a damn how old you is. Like people used to tell me that, you right? Know, you ain't never too old, you jab boy. Exactly. <laughs> what? I know where you stay. At. He said. He said you are. Huh? Do the audio? Yeah. Let's get the audio. Let's get the audio, man. man. Ah, beat, but what? I don't care who you is. plug into that phone, cause that is the phone. You. Uh, yeah, the little hole under the phone. Oh yeah, my playboy. Okay. Okay. If you think I'm bringing this paper, let me say it like this: When your bitch ass starts getting some shit that disrespects women that get your skinny motherfucking ass back out of your goddamn way. I dare you. 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 Shut the fuck up. I'm old. 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 I ain't, he was going in. He was spazzing. First off, the black community is not is not new to this. First off, this is not new. He was spazzing. <laughs> he, was, he, was, he, was, he was going hard. <laughs> you hear me? You was just on the little mini piano going a little. You feel me? Hey, we should we should have knew he he was stopping. He got a song named Stop. Look, he was he he, 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 was, he was about this. After he was supposed to drop that song with Young Boy, we should have already knew what kind of person. We should have knew. We should have knew. We should have knew. But I mean, but that's how. It, but no cap, honestly, that's how it be. That's, that's how it be. be. That's really how that's it be. How it be like you have the most holy people, but it's like if they feel like they're being disrespected by. And by you know, own, that's that older generation. Uh, like they, what? How that saying go? You, what they say? What they say? Spread the rod. What? What? It, it's some. <laughs> <laughs> we know. We know. Yo, if you know, you know. And if we don't, you need to go to church. Yeah, yeah, anytime yeah, I hear yeah. me. So, but you know, the, you know, the white community that hasn't really seen that side of Kirk Franklin or surprised. So he felt the need he had to apologize. Do you think he he should have apologized for something like that? Put it this way, I don't feel like he should apologize for the way he came off at his son. Right. Because you're gonna handle your son how you gonna handle your son. Exactly. But I just feel like he he just need to apologize of, of how he came out. Right, right. You know it was the son that put it out. The exactly. son recording. I feel yeah, like the son should have apologized, boy. Cause ain't no way you got me out looking crazy, boy. Boy, I <laughs> see my son. 
I'm on your ass. <laughs> I'm on your ass. Come here. Did not tell you, <laughs> boy. Hey, and he's like, you ever, yeah. For real. Yeah, but it sounded like the son told him to shut up. Mm-hmm. If son like, said something bro, stupid, said something. If I ever was to tell my mama to shut up, you wouldn't leave. Bro, my mama, boy, look, I'm my boy. I ain't even going to. Mm. <laughs> you feel me? RP Nigel. I'm going to be done. Mm. Ain't no way. Right. I don't want no parts. No. So, so on, on to the next thing. So, I don't know if you will wear the Grammys happen. Few days ago, I, I heard, I heard a little swoop. So, Blue Ivy, Beyonce, and Jay Z's daughter, nine years old, won a Grammy at nine years old. For the Grammy, she won. <laughs> I think it was for, I think it was for, uh, uh, what's it like? Best R&B song. Who? Best R&B song. Best R&B song. Mm-hmm. She got a song. Blue Ivy, yes. How did she got a song? I think she's on uh, Beyonce. Like you know, Beyonce has like projects and stuff. Brown skin girl. Brown skin girl. Oh, brown skin girl. Yeah. She was singing. Yes. Mm-hmm. In the song. Yeah. She's, she's on one of Grammy. Blue Ivy. Nine years old. Blue Lord, Ivy. Lord, yes. Lord. Hey. Yes. Yes. Blue I mean, Ivy. Bro, her mother. Is what was you doing at nine her years old? Her mother is Beyonce. <laughs> and her father's Jay Z. Like. Her mother is Beyonce. <laughs> I'm not saying Jay Z. I'm pretty sure Jay Z can't sing. You feel me? Like. I don't know. He, but he's lyrical, lyrical though. He's lyrical though. He's lyrical. Yeah. He's, he's so he, you know what I'm saying? Where he got what he in? Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. 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 You mean? Like, bro, speaking of effing people, you know that boy Kanye is worth six point six billion. Yes, that's what bro. that's what I heard. And now you have you heard Forbes came out talking about something? Well, he really got one. He really worth one point six. One point six what? Billion. Yeah. But he's saying he, he's saying he's six point six. Yeah. So they who see, really lies? Is he boasting his numbers or I mean what's happening? They say he's saying this is for his because you know he already got that thing going on with the Yeezy. Yeah. And then but you know he just signed another deal with uh Gap. Yeah. Oh Gap, yeah. that's you I think it. that's yeah, and that's they was like that's what you feel me. Put him over. That's what you feel. That's crazy. They're saying he's now the richest man, black man. Yes, in history. In history. Yes. Mm, 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 mm. Kanye mm-hmm. West. I guess Sway didn't have the answers. <laughs> <laughs> so this is my I guess so I'm curious is like so since he's worth six point six billion, right? Is she still filing a divorce? Yes. Oh, she's still filing she a divorce. Is. Yeah. That she gonna go through it. <laughs> yeah, she does. She, 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 she got them kids out there, mom. I tell she got them. She knows what she was doing. Yeah, she's she trying to get that bread. bread. See, she that's the that problem. Bread. Stop getting got. Stop getting got. Stop getting <laughs> trapped. This right. came out. She came out with a grill. She came out with a grill. Everybody was talking about on Instagram. Have y'all seen it? She got a grill. She got a grill with like a like a birth like a birthstone. You know how everybody has like areas or whatever and like spending kind of money. Get a grill to get grill. Don't be doing dumb shit. You know, you know they do. Ex, you know they got to be got a damn diamond in his head. And him and JT are just <laughs> now. What's not love? Now what if y'all fight? Somebody, come here. I'll take your diamond. <laughs> Bitch, give me your That's going to hurt. Give me your opinion stone. Give me your opinion stone. I ain't going to like that. The ground. Oh, yeah. They funny, boy. They hell, boy. They high. They, they are they cringy. Just a little bit. Yeah. But, you know, they ain't love. Have you seen Coming to America too? No. Are you planning on still watching it? No. <laughs> Why not? I haven't seen the first Coming to America. Oh, you never seen the first one? I promise you. Well, I I've never been a fan, bro. Of who? I just never been a fan of the, just to come to America. Got you, got you. In general. Now I was, I was, I what was I? I was somewhere, I was somewhere. We were somewhere shooting, shooting a, a set for the short film. Right. And we was hearing people saying, you know, talking about the coming to America, and they were saying, you know, that you know that they might not watch it. Right. Because they've been hearing uh, uh, up to the expectation right. that they want. Right. I feel like I haven't, I haven't seen it yet, but it sounds like when people speak about it. They feel like it wasn't as good as it could have been. Yeah. So it's still good, but you probably not gonna top the first one because the first one was just too funny. It was it was a classic. First one was a classic. So I, don't, I gotta watch. It. Yeah, I, I haven't seen the second one yet, but I'm definitely planning on watching the second one. Yeah. Follow that. Follow. Oh, yeah, you watch it. Let me know. Let me know. <laughs> he said, "Let me know." He said, "Let me know how you feel about it." You know, okay, bad for sure, for sure, for sure. Last thing we're gonna talk about. I don't know. So, you know, Timberland and um, Swiss Beats, they made verses during the pandemic. You know, mm-hmm. they were well, somebody battle somebody else. Right. So, they sold verses to Triller. You remember Triller, that app, you know. Triller. To Triller. Hell was Triller. 
you know the app Trilla. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, with well, the music app. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. They sold versus the Trilla for four hundred million dollars. <coughs> Is that a boss move or what? Mm-hmm. But the thing is, versus the people that own versus, right? Like all they state people that have a piece in it, they own a part, a part of Trillion. So they still will be making money while they sold versus mm-hmm. two Trillion. Mm-hmm. Ain't that crazy? Just hold on, bro. Why are we even thinking that beforehand? Mm-hmm. But they just started what versus what? I don't, I don't a, a year ago mm-hmm. when the pandemic started. Mm-hmm. Is it exactly year? Yeah, yeah exactly year. <laughs> it took a year to flip it to 400 M's. Bruh. Black hey, excellence. Hey, that's black God. excellence. That's that's black a, excellence. Count y'all blessings. Hey. hey. My, man, fuck counting blessings. Break bread. Break bread. Break bread. <laughs> Break bread. Tell, tell them what you do. Tell them to cut the check. Cut the, cut the check. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Cut the pie. Cut the cake. Cut the cake. Break bread. You feel me? Your pocket's heavy. He <laughs> said your pocket's heavy. No, they pocket's full like rock. <laughs> They wrong for that. Yeah. Holding it up like hostage. What's up? Helping me out. What's up? Black X. What's up? That was. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> I mean, I be, I be here. I be like, damn, I could have thought of some shit like that. That's what I'm saying. Like, I be looking on TikTok. They doing all these little guys. I, mean, I could have did that. I could have did that. Yeah, I could have made that song. I mean, it's all right. I'm, I'm gonna pop out one day. <laughs> you know, yeah. Good bright ass idea, like ding. Hey, let's go. Just go take off. Oh, go ahead and take off. I'm not all right. <laughs> and I'm not coming back. <laughs> and with that being said, that's the end of the episode, man. Make sure y'all like and subscribe. Leave a comment down down below. Go oh, follow man. us on IG. Follow the podcast page College down in the description, man. Peace.